the day that she goes back. I've never actually showed her. But here she is. Our big car. <laughs> you have seen the inside loads of times, but never without the car seats. Oh, headrest. Forgot the headrest. It's a good job I did do this. It's in the ottoman upstairs. This is like the boot size with the seats, but them seats can be taken out as well. We've never had this in, <laughs> ever. First time it's been on since we got it. This just feels so sad. And not because, oh, we won't have a car, because we've got one sitting right there waiting for us. But it just feels sad. Like, this is the last thing with Sue's name on it, you know? House is gone. She's gone. The funeral's over and done with. This is the last possession of his and this is going to it just feels sad i will be forever thankful that at a time when we were struggling to find a car that was an affordable amount every month that sue came to us and helped us with this and enabled me to have my first couple of months of driving in a car that I didn't have to worry about breaking down or anything like that. Sometimes when you buy part-worn cars, that can happen, can't it? But she enabled me to have the best experience of driving in a brand new car. Sometimes scary, not gonna lie, sometimes absolutely terrifying because it was a lot to get used to driving such a modified car can compared to the car that I learnt in anyway. Yeah, she <laughs> enabled me to have the best types of drive and, and make the best memories with our kids and make the best memories with her as well. I'll be forever grateful for that. But this part just sucks. It really does. <coughs> and as I've said, it's not about the car because we've got one sitting there waiting and we can... We can go places and we can still go everywhere the same places as we've been in this, but it just doesn't feel the same. As simple as that. I know you told your friend you're not okay. And tell me what's wrong and why you never said you felt that way. And guess you're trying to stay strong and fake a smile until I look away. But I've known you too long, it hurts to watch your blue eyes fade to grey As you fade away As you fade away And we've arrived, so bye bye car And it's all done and yeah, I did blubber and it went because of giving the car back. I was all put together, wasn't I? And then he said, sorry for your loss. And when people say that, that's when it gets you. Um, but now we're just walking to the train station <coughs> to start our new journey, aren't we? Yeah. We're out of the car. <laughs> it feels ridiculous that I feel like I'm crying because I took a car back. Okay, but it's not that it's not that at all well this feels alien even though we've, we've done it recently we were like literally on the tra train in May but I've just been like what ticket's best for us to get me and he was like the safe way and we kind of knew it was the safe way but just in case anything had changed wasn't it I believe that there's a new thing on where you can get I think it's your children to Liverpool for one pound from from Headbutt Lane and you can get yourselves for two pounds. But from here we have to get like this save away things, day saver, so we can go on the train as many times as we want today. Mm. Not that we want to like there won't be anywhere where we'll be going all that. But yeah, um, give away some of the train station Yeah, that's a good um, idea. Give them to somebody who's waiting to pay. Yeah, pass it on. And let me just tell you, it just cost us a tenner. A tenner to get home. It cost us what? About 50p to get up here. Yeah. <laughs> um. I know 
to Liverpool for a couple of minutes because our train got cancelled and we've got a 40 minute wait so rather than just stand around in the train station we've come to get a drink and show something to eat because he's peckish aren't ya? Yeah. You got us food, he's happy. Yeah, I'm he's been dying from the season salad wrap haven't ya? Yeah. All week, the week that you just began. All last week. <laughs> I got a drink and some £1.39 nuggets but my drink was on me. Thank you. I used to go into McDonald's a lot. You get points to get things for free. So, yeah. Right, be sad. We've just almost missed this train. But how did you read that from all the escalator? Which, Don't stand right next to it. Which way does that cancelled or headbutt? Got really good eyesight. So, up the top, it said that this train was cancelled. So, I was like, oh, it's been cancelled again. Yeah. But you carried on running, didn't you? Yeah, it's a good job you did. Otherwise, we'd have missed this and the next one would have been cancelled. Yeah. Because <laughs> it was the next one. Well, it turns out that every single train to Kirby has been cancelled after this one, hasn't it? <coughs> so we got, we got lucky. We got lucky that we got on this. Um, we arrived. Just walk. Back at Kirby. <laughs> I won't have you walked. The hill 20, up and 20 the hill. Years we walked. 21 years we walked and I walked the hill length of Blackpool. The other day you were moaning about it and yeah. I didn't moan once. We're going to cross the road. You walk too fast though, Dad. Sorry. I, I do walk fast. Stores like a cracker. How would you? Why would you say that? So I we'll go over the bricks. <laughs> we're going out to walk. I don't know if I'm meant to swing my arms, whether I'm supposed to hold the front to me and do this. I've completely forgot of you. <laughs> I forgot how hard it is to walk. I'm walking like this. Dun, 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 when I haven't got this bloody cold that you have all passed on to <coughs> very kindly. We should. Yeah. You can take it back if you want. I've got the chest for this type of crap. Mm -hmm. <laughs> We're just fitting our car rough. seats. What? Is it my seatbelt's a bit rough? Rough? Yeah. Oh, is that ripped? Just fitting the car seats in the car. It's a bit bigger, isn't it, than your other, other car? Eh? You couldn't yeah. strap it in without having the door open. And this is Ebony's seat. And it also, we got these for the back of them. So you can put like stuff in here, iPad, phone, drinks holders, pencil holders, snacks, and all of that jazz. We got them one each. So they can still hold the drinks because they had a, a pull down um, table in the other car and it had a cup holder in it. Not that you used it all that often, but the doors also had cup holders where these doors aren't that big, are they? I wonder if your cups do actually fit in these. We haven't tried it out yet, have we? But yeah, it's it's good. It's all good. My seatbelt's a little bit minging. Um, it's got this weird stuff on it, like sticky. So that needs like steam on. But other than that, it's, it's all right. Welcome to the new car, guys. I'm just saying welcome to the new car. I need to do something with that. <coughs> it doesn't move. And there's no way I can put it really without it I like it, the... it. I know, but watch. Watch the view. So it, um, you're getting a lot of the front of the car <coughs> rather than like the roads when you're driving. But I have actually been gifted a tripod tripod thing and i'm sure it turns into a car so thing, so. communication yeah
It's lemon. Lemon. Yeah, look. Wanna try? Yeah. You gonna try some? Yeah. Yeah? It's it's like orange juice, but it's lemon. Lemon. Yeah. Uh, you can try it. <laughs> is that nice? But I need the It's like orange juice. Yeah. Bite it. Yeah, Spicy? No. We don't eat this bit, okay? We just eat this bit. What is it? A pineapple. It's like a pineapple? Yeah, like a grape. Like a grape. It's a little My, bit like everything, isn't it? Like is it nice? Ticket. Do you like it? No? I can't make you a juice with this, babe. You won't like it. Oh, okay. Maria wants some. Uh -huh. it up. Here you go. Up. Taste that one. I'm making a drink for my colds because mummy can't stop coughing. Mummy wants. Mom. Mom. Yeah. I'm gone a minute. You want me to make you some? No. Yeah. No, no, Mom. No, Mom, you get it. Eh. No, Mommy, be up. Mommy, Mommy. What? Mommy, spicy, that. It's spicy? Yeah. Mommy, spicy. Oh, is it? Okay. Do you want orange juice instead? Oh, yeah. Yeah? Daddy can't stop coughing. 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 Daddy can't stop as the day has gone on, my cold has gotten worse and worse. My chest feels terrible. This is helping now. Also, I forgot to defrost my mints to make kebab. So instead, I'm making chicken kebab, which this is for chicken. So uh, that's what I'm making right now, chicken kebab. video again yesterday i think the last thing you seen me doing was making a honey and lemon drink and that was because my cold had started getting worse and worse 
and this morning I've woke up absolutely terrible. So I've not vlogged at all today. So I'm not sure when our next vlog I'll be going up because I feel an absolute dog poop. That's that's a a good way of putting it. But he's trying to convince me to go to the doctors because he said that my chest sounds very much like it did when I had pneumonia. However, the rest of the family have had this cold and they've all been okay within a day or two after having it really bad like this. So I'm going to try and hold it out because I don't think having antibiotics all the time, especially if it's like precautionary, is good for you. And I know I have had pneumonia once before and I've had suspected pneumonia a couple of months ago. I'm not having fever or anything like that. And I think you know yourself, don't you? So I think right now I'm okay, but I'm just gonna have a couple of days of rest. I'm not gonna go out anyway. I'm gonna stay in. I'm still gonna get fresh air because I'm just gonna go out and breathe in because I know that's really good for you. But I'm not gonna be going out out anyway because Ebony had a couple of days in and that helped you as well, didn't it, having a couple of days in. So I think I'll be okay in a day or two. It's just the cough, it really takes it out of you your chest it really does um but yeah um thank you everybody for watching and i'll see you again soon for another video